If we ain't crunching, we ain't hunting. <laughs> Hi guys, welcome. So as you can see, we have our chicken parm, which, which I am so excited to be about to demolish. Baby, if this was a fire, I'm about to extinguish this so fast. Let me see our first bite and listen to that. That's how it's supposed to sound. That's what he said. <laughs> so let's see, let's see. Mmm, mmm, mmm. Oh my gosh, that is so good. Now let's chat. Let's talk. So it's this girl on my Facebook page, right? So pretty, so pretty. I went to school with her. And so far I see that she's an ally for the LGBT community. And she posted a trans girl on her page the other day. And the person that started the post was like, gotta be careful because like, this is how trans people look. And so she was like, okay, and she's pretty. Like when she posted it, when she reposted it, she was like, okay, and she's pretty, period. She so I go and read the comments, child. And of course it under her post talking about some he slash she is so pretty. He slash she is so pretty. Like I was following him back in such and such. And it's, and it's like the backhanded compliments. What is the reason? Like, why can't you just respect people for who they are or like respect people's pronouns? It's literally not that, not that difficult. It'd be 150% respect her because she has been an ally so far. Um, from what I see on her page for the trans community. And I think that is such a beautiful, for like the whole LGBT community, first of all. And I think that is such a beautiful thing and I commend her, you know? Mm. Y'all, this is so delicious. Baby, I'm about to put this out like a fire. And the thing is, I'm gonna be mad when it's gone because I gotta save some for work tomorrow. Oh, oh my God. Mm. Y'all, this is so good. Mm. You hear that crunch of that garlic bread? That's how it's supposed to be. If we ain't crunching, we ain't hunting. <laughs> you know actually where it comes from? Yeah, I just be saying stuff. I just be saying the first thing that comes to my own. Mmm. Ah. Mmm. Mm hmm Y'all need to make this too. I hope y'all make this because it is so worth it. It is so worth it. I be trying not to in the cooking videos, I be trying not to taste my food. So that way, like when I come over on this channel, the first bite that y'all see is the first time that I'm tasting it. But I done cooked this before. So I already know how it tastes. So I definitely, definitely ate some off the camera, baby. I was starving. Um, mm. And just garlic bread. Mm. I need to learn how to make garlic bread from scratch. Because that'll be a little bit Nah, that'll be too much work. That'll be a long video. Trying to make stuff from scratch? Mm mm. That would be a really, really long video. Have y'all ever worked in retail before? Cause I currently work in retail. Let me say, it's a job, but. People love you being on my nerves, child. Shall y'all be coming into my establishment talking about some I can never find an employee and then when I can find one, they don't know. They don't work in that department. Mm -mm. 
I'm not gonna touch it. Never mind. <laughs> Never mind. Mmm. <sighs> Don't y'all love a good soda that just burn y'all chest to the core? <laughs> a good soda that just burn. I remember one time I had almost got addicted to Coca-Cola and I was having one every single day, child. And I had to stay away from the house because, and I was only drinking it because I was getting that little, I was talking about something. <sighs> getting that little burn. That's the only reason. One thing about it is, a Coca-Cola gonna always do it for you. Y'all, this is so good. And if y'all make it, and you say that it's not, girl, you know you lying for real. Or maybe I'm just hungry and a little tipsy. Nah, baby. I thought that I thought that it was gonna come out crazy because I used quite a bit of Lars seasoning salt. I did. I used quite a bit of that, but it came out a okay. A okay. Mm. Baby, it's true. Mm -mm. Not me over here trying to smack. I almost made myself mad when I heard that. Oh, I can't stand that. Mm. What's some good movies y'all been watching? Y'all put some good movies down. Put some good movies down in the comment section. Because I love watching movies. I do. That's one of my favorite things to do. Baby, I could sit home in my pajamas all day, every day and watch movies. If I could get paid to just watch movies, that's definitely what I would do. Mmm. Y'all. Oh, oh my God. Y'all, what's wrong with these men? <laughs> right now, I'm not dating nobody. I don't want to date. I don't care to date. I was talking to a friend on the phone. But yesterday, and I was telling her, I was like, mm, I'm so over dating these men. Because they for real, for real only be coming because they only just want one thing. And then with Trent and Jen, and it's just like, dang. I want to be wanted because I'm a good person. Not because you see me as a fetish. Not because you see me as somebody to help you relieve yourself. You know what I mean? Like that's weird. That's crazy to me. But it seems to be that's the world that we live in, and that is so crazy to me. Whatever happened to chivalry? Like what happened to it? You know something that I hate about working in customer service or in retail is the fact that people stare. It's like. Mm. Hold on. Hold that thought. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But it's like, ever since, well, it was crazy before COVID. But it's like, ever since people done came out of COVID, child, it's done got worse. People just stare at you, and it's like, hey, speak. Say hi. How are you? How was your day, girl? Ask a question. People be staring at my face. I be like, girl, what is you just staring at? You need help or what? Like, cut it out. That's rude. So just stare in people's face. Mm. Mm hmm. Baby, this gotta be ain't no joke. That Texas toast. It's so nice and buttery. Mm. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. Y'all, I'm trying to talk, but the way I'm hungry. Yeah. This ain't gonna make it to work tomorrow. Don't judge me. Shoot. 
It's y'all fault. I'm eating like I'm eating like this child. A honey bun in a bag of chips. Just so I can come home and be starving. And cook for y'all. Mmm. Don't be ungrateful. Don't do that. Mmm. Oh. And it's like, this is like the best meal. <laughs> That's how you know you be hungry. When everything seems like it's the best meal in the world. Either you hungry or you high. One of the two. Baby, eating high. That's another reason I had to quit playing with the devil's lettuce. Because, baby, I get toasted and want to eat everything that ain't nailed down to the table. And I mean everything, baby. If I could have ate the table itself, after being toasted, I would have did it. Mm hmm. I would have did it. Oh, this is so good. Ooh. Mm hmm. The bacon bits added just the right amount of. The right amount of right amount of. Baby, this is busting. Busting, 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 busting. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. mm -hmm. The way. You know, I've been scraping the plate like that. And I am, because I'm hungry. I was, I was hungry. I'm good now. That was just about that long. Baby, I'm full. So, make sure that y'all like, comment, and subscribe. And turn that notification bell on so anytime that I post. Oof. Y'all are one of the first to know. And I hope that y'all burping. Because if y'all cook this and y'all not burping, I'm going to be, and y'all not burping, I'm going to be offended. Okay? Because this is like my own little country. On this YouTube channel, this is my little country. And in my little country, when you come over here and eat, it's required that you burp. If you don't burp, I'm going to be offended. All right. Thank y'all so much. Bye.